OEMs did a great job getting cost structures and excess capacity under control in the last few years. Vehicle production versus demand were brought into line while sales increased. First and foremost, from an OE standpoint, um, OEMs have done a very good job over the past five to six years, especially coming out of the recession and getting their cost structure in, in, in order. Um, as you well know, the, the bane of the industry was excess capacity, that and the labor issues that they were dealing with. Uh, they did a very good job, were very assiduous in taking down excess capacity and whatnot. And right now we're in a period where uh, utilization, capacity utilization is running north of 90%. Um, now, you, remember, you may remember back in 2010, that figure was around uh, in the mid-60s. Um, so the industry's done a very good job on that, but we've been through periods of time uh, where things have fluctuated, where uh, capacity starts to build up. You have to thus rely on more subvention to move product, and that subvention, that, that's an absolute drag on industry profitability. So far, the industry has been very circumspect in keeping better alignment between production and, and demand. And that's, we feel that's one of the first and foremost issues that they have to deal with. That's a controllable for them, um, that they have to continue that discipline going forward in the event sales start to, to moderate as we foresee that they will. Um, in terms of dealerships, dealerships have also done a very good job in Painfully so, uh, the lessons learned in a downturn, but they've also, uh, for the most part, gotten their operations in better alignment where they can be profitable at lower volumes. Um, it, it's key to, to, um, to step back from the euphoria that we've had, because we have very strong years in terms of revenue and profit generation at both the OEs and the retailers, but to make sure that those lessons learned and the changes that we put together into the cost structure maintain because the industry is going to slow. It'll, it'll grow more moderately, but it's, it's a, approaching a natural peak. And when you have a lot of new product coming out and a lot of people making big bets for, for growth, not all of that's going to happen. So again, uh, being more judicious and circumspect on that is going to be key for the industry going forward.